According to a recently disclosed patent, Yamaha may be entering the market for electrically assisted turbocharged bikes, much like Honda. According to a Yamaha patent, the Iwata plan is thinking about using an electronic turbo e-turbo system, and a possible new motorbike with the CP3 engine is being developed. Honda's presentation of the V3 concept, a novel design with a more thrilling aspiration system, at EICMA last year caused a stir. The Honda V3 employed an electronically assisted turbo in place of a traditional turbo, or supercharging, and it's possible that other companies are also thinking about using this technology. A naked motorbike with a profile resembling one of Yamaha's CP3-powered vehicles is depicted in the company's recent patent. The graphic just depicts the location of the intake, manifold, and engine, as well as how the system would be incorporated into the motorbike. It doesn't include many technical specifics. Stricter emission standards are one factor driving the switch to e-turbo. Getting 1,000 cc of performance out of a much smaller displacement engine makes perfect sense because manufacturers are subject to ever stricter regulations. Additionally, you may be asking yourself, why not just use a regular turbo? Motorcycles equipped with traditional turbos have a unique set of mechanical problems. First of all, compared to the car sector, motorcycles have significantly less room. By switching to an e-turbo, you may, to a reasonable extent, position the system's functional components in a way that maximizes the bike's thin packaging. Heat and latency are two other problems with conventional turbos, which are typically powered by the engine's exhaust gases. Turbos, which are powered by exhaust gases, may reach temperatures of over 1,000 degrees Celsius. With so much heat released from the parts, even a tiny vehicle like a motorbike can have a significant impact. Another issue with exhaust-driven turbos is a phenomenon known as turbo lag, in which the turbo only produces its maximum power after its turbines have spooled up or achieved their maximum speed, to use the slang word.